ওয়েলকাম টু সৌমিত্র ক্যানভাস টুডে উই উইল ড্র দিস বিউটিফুল ফরেস্ট সিন নো দ্য টেকনিক হ্যার ইউ ক্যান সি দ্য ডিটেল ড্রয়িং অফ দ্য সিনারি টু কিপ দ্য পেপার হোয়াইট অফ দ্য ট্রি ট্যাঙ্ক আই এম কভারিং দ্য ট্র্যাঙ্ক উইথ ইস মাস্কিং টেপ আই উইল কভার অল দ্য ট্রি ট্যাঙ্ক নো উইথ দিস শার্প পেপার নাইফ আই উইল কাট দ্য মাস্কিং টেপ অ্যাকর্ডিং টু দ্য ড্রয়িং বাট ইউ হ্যাভ টু বি ভেরি কেয়ারফুল সো দ্যাট দ্য পেপার শুড নট কাট অ্যান্ড ইউ হ্যাভ টু সো মাচ প্রিসাইজ অ্যাবাউট ইউর ওয়ার্ক অ্যাজ দ্য মাস্কিং টেপ ইজ সেমি ট্রান্সপারেন্ট ইউ ক্যান ইজিলি সি দ্য ড্রয়িং আন্ডার দ্য মাস্কিং টেপ অ্যান্ড ইউ ক্যান কাট অ্যাকর্ডিং টু দ্যাট অ্যান্ড আই উইল রিমুভ অল দ্য এক্সট্রা পোর্শন অফ দ্য মাস্কিং টেপ অ্যান্ড ইউ ক্যান সি আই হ্যাভ অলরেডি কমপ্লিটেড all the tree tank the man and the goats are also covered now i will start to color the scenery with light green color to create the depth of the forest i am also using dark green mixing of gamboge and prussian blue i will cover all the blank space so that the masking tape should be visible and i it will help me to do the next work clearly if you not cover you can't identify where are the masking tapes are so i'm coloring the uncovered area of the forest scenery I am using a white and red technique to get a very realistic look and it is very natural. I will also cover the road with mix of bandsana and cobalt blue. My first layer is completed and adding some details of the scenery with some dark color to create the depth. and you can see i am using a mix of prussian blue and gamboge yellow and a tint of burnt china now you can see that i am adding some more details i am also trying to get the leafy effect of the trees and i am detailing that in that such a way that you can see now i am to get this you have to use multiple layer of colors and multiple shades of color so that it looks very natural and sometimes i am using white on white technique and now i am is adding some small very tiny details so it looks like natural I have completed a part and now I am removing the first masking tape of the first tree trunk. I am coloring tree trunk with a mix of burnt sienna and Prussian blue. I will lift up some area to get a highlighted effect. I am adding some leaves. To make it more realistic. I will also make the trunk more realistic with some dark shades of color. Now I am removing another masking tape of another tree tent. and sometimes it is hard to remove that but you have to be careful add some more details with colors and that it looks the behind that trees and hidden i am removing other 
masking tips from other trees sometimes you have to be careful more that it should not tear the paper and there should be no residuals also I'm adding some leaves in front of this tree. I'm adding some more details. other tips when you are removing the masking tape you should peel up in an angle way completed removing the masking tape i will start to color it again here i am adding some leaves Highlighted effect, I will lift up some colors. I am adding a bush in front of the tree to make it more natural. I First layer of leaves are completed. Now I will start to begin to color the trunk. coloring you should always remember that you have to give the depth of that particular object you are coloring I'm adding some more details that it look natural and more realistic and beautiful you have to keep your patience when you are coloring if you can't remain calm, you can't give the desired details you are working on. Multiple layer of colors make it more realistic. To make it more natural, we have to use many different shades of color a variety of dark and light shades dark color are used to make depth and shades and light color are used to make it closer and highlighted portion to create the highlight we'll uncover the other tree trunks also. completed and i have again started to 
color with some dark shades. I am using different shades and different dark shades to get the desired effect I want, the depth of the forest and trying to create the contrast between the highlighted portion and the dark portion of the forest. When you are painting the bush or the tree or the leafy parts of the tree, you paint in you should paint in such a way that the leafy character of the tree should be visible. It will distinguish it from the other parts of the tree. I am adding more colors and creating more details. Coloring the other trunks of this forest. My first layer is completed and I am adding more details to all other trunks. More depth of color with more dark set. Now I will color the grassy lands with some bright green and also using the dark set to create the natural effect. Now I am adding the dark set in the path. The path is complete, so I am adding green right side of this pic to create the grass effect. I am adding some more details, the dark tone to create some effect of grass and bush. is complete and now I am adding detail to the logs of the trees. I am giving some strokes of dark colors. Some thin and some are the thick.